Morning guys, welcome back to the farm in Thailand with Toon and Lee and something fishy for you today. Last night we got a, a, a late order for a couple of kg of our baduk, which are the walking catfish. So uh, Toon and I grabbed the rods, or our bamboo sticks rather, and uh, we fished a few out last night. Popped them in the keep net and uh, they're just down here behind us. So we're going to throw the GoPro in there so you can have a good look at these amazing creatures. Um, I wouldn't say they're particularly attractive fish, they're, they're bloody tasty, I know that. Um, but even their mothers wouldn't even think that their kids are uh, attractive. So we're going to throw the camera in there and try and give you a bit of a close-up before they go off to their new home. I mean their, their new pan. This is the holding tank that we use. Now they are quite battle scarred. They weren't when we put them in early last evening, but there's two reasons why they're a bit uh, beaten around the edges. The first one being that their, their side fins are uh, quite sharp. So that when you put them into a keep net and lift up the net, the sharp fins are, are uh, scratching each other. And then the other one is, they're actually in the crayfish pond and crayfish do like the taste of catfish so it seems so they've had a bit of a nibble on them but uh, it's nothing serious and i'm sure they'll still taste good so hopefully that's turned out quite well for you we're very happy with the uh, the rate that they're growing now uh, main reason being that we put the bug light on for every single night uh, for for a lot longer than we used to and we also are convinced that because the uh, the floating aquatic plant that's now on the pond it's attracting so many bugs that they're they're eating a lot healthier a lot more higher protein than the uh, the catfish food that we give them so that's it guys short and sweet today and i'm sure there'll be more catfish videos coming in the future thanks for watching as always take care out there it's for now